Ellen. And I'm Isis. And welcome to Naturally Delicious. Today we're going to be making a scarlet quinoa salad in a creamy squash soup. This is quinoa. I've already rinsed it because it has saponin on the outside of it. And saponin has a bitter flavor and you have to rinse it off before you can cook it. So I think we should put the lemon juice in the quinoa because the quinoa actually expands when it cooks. So it will actually absorb the lemon flavor. So we like that. We're going to get started in our creamy winter squash soup. So we're going to start it off with some red onions. And we're going to saute the fennel with it. This is fennel. It has kind of a licorice-y flavor. And we'll saute those two together. And then we'll add in a little bit of garlic and a little bit of ginger. And then a little bit of squash later on. Mm. And then we'll add in our sweet miso for some seasoning and some salt. Puree it. And you have a beautiful creamy squash soup. Here at Naturally Delicious, we believe in teamwork. So Ellen is dropping in our beautifully and perfectly sliced red onions, and we're going to do some layer salting. The importance of layer salting helps to bring out the flavor of each vegetable that you add to the dish. Helps to make it sweeter. Let's yeah. add a little garlic. And we won't be making out later, so I think it'll be okay. One of my favorite things about this dish is that it totally satisfies or satiates, because I love that word, it's an SAT word, I learned it in eighth grade, um, your <laughs> sweet craving. So instead of reaching for the candy bar, have some squash soup. While she's cutting up the apple, I'm going to add the squash into the soup. The onions and the fennel are now, they've now been sauteing for about five or ten minutes. And then we'll add in the apple, we'll add in the squash, and we'll add in a little bit of ginger too. The quinoa has tripled in size from where we started. Mmm. Here, let's it get smells it. so good, and I'm getting a facial at the same time. I love it. We are making a scarlet quinoa salad today. Well, the scarlet comes from these grated beets. Ellen and I, as I said, we believe in teamwork. Beautiful. And there is your scarlet quinoa salad. This looks amazing. That looks so tasty. One of the things about making a creamy squash squash or making a <laughs> squeamish, squeamish, squeamish crotch soup. <laughs> One of the things about making a creamy squash soup is that all of the flavors are blended together. So you get to taste everything in one bite. Let's do it. I'm gonna blend it up. a beautiful meal today. Yum. It's a look good, feel good meal. It looks good. It's going to feel good when you eat it. And then you're going to look good and feel good. Thanks for joining us today. We hope we've inspired you to try some new dishes at home. Today we had creamy squash soup and scarlet quinoa salad. They look good, they taste good, and they are naturally, naturally delicious. delicious. Yum! So good. Alright, let's mm. trade. I want to try the same.